after the end I don't know neither did they they were just an army engineer battalion constructing roads and bridges deep in the middle of the Arizona nowhere they didn't know why Armageddon had come they'd heard radio chatter about an attack on some space-based missile platform but who had attacked it or why no one knew what they did know is that the politicians and the generals had finally ended the world. Now, everything was gone. They took over a federal prison for a fort, kicked out the convicts, got busy starting from scratch. Maybe it was an act of mercy. Maybe they figured that the prisoners would die out in the harsh new world. Whichever, it came back to bite the engineers in the ass. Cultists, criminals, cannibals. They've been living with the fallout ever since. Good people had survived too, called for help in the night. And those engineers, those common soldiers, could not stand by and see them die. So they came out of their fort and they helped the survivors defend their homes. And for that, they earned a new name, a proud name, the Desert Rangers. Now Rangers, I know at times, it seems our cause is hopeless and I know it's hard to say goodbye to a brother in arms. But I want you to know something else. That no ranger who dies in the line of duty will ever be forgotten. Nor will he have ever died in vain or unavenged. Thank you, recruits. I appreciate you coming to Captain Ace's retirement party when you hardly knew the man. Appropriate too, seeing as how investigating his death will be your first duty as a desert ranger. Ace had been trying to locate a faint radio signal, which has lately been giving us cause for concern. We gave him three repeater units and sent him to hook him up to three remote radio towers. This would have allowed us to get a fix on the signal. But sadly, Ace was murdered by unknown assailants right after hooking up the first tower, and his logbook and the last two repeater units were stolen. Yeah, I know. You've hardly found your feet with us, and here I am sending you on a mission that already got one ranger killed. Well, I wish I had another option, but the desert rangers are spread a little thin right now. Ranger teams Abel and Charlie are out west trying to stop a range war out there from becoming straight-up genocide. 
and Team Baker is up north looking for a way through the radiation that's cut us off from Vegas. I'm afraid the next generation is going to have to lead the charge on this one. The mission is this, search the area where Ace's body was found and do your best to recover his logbook and the repeater units, then call in your report. If you find the repeaters, I may send you on to finish his mission. Ace's death must be avenged, and it will be, but finding the signal he died trying to track down is just as important. Besides, I got the sneaking suspicion that when you find the one, you'll find the other. Where the heck do you think you're going, recruits? I know you're eager to get out into the field, but I haven't told you where you're heading yet. Now settle in and listen. The place where Ace was found is about a day's walk east from here. I'll mark it on your map. You'll start your search for the repeaters and the logbook there. There, now you know where to go. Good luck out there, recruits. What? Mind picking up that can over there for me? I think there's some water in there. <laughs> he headbutted you right in the butt. God damn it, Ace. You never should have put down the wrench and picked up the gun. Sorry about the waterworks. I'm still pretty broke up over Ace. I'm Angie. You kids must be the new recruits old Vargas trained up. Lord, y'all just... They all hurt, but this one... Man... Ace wasn't even a ranger. Not first. He worked as a driver and mechanic for Fair and Brigo up in Vegas. When Base Cochise started sending its death machines into the desert, Brigo sent Ace south to recruit robot fighters. We met him in court. He pissed somebody off out there and they locked him up. We sorted that out and he started running with us, helping us fight Cochise. He never stopped. Vargas eventually gave him the uniform and the hat. But I don't think he ever formally signed on. He was just always there. And now he's... He... God damn it, Ace. I knew this one was trouble. I knew it. You, you noticed that, huh? Well, Ace always said I wore my heart on my sleeve. Yeah, me and Ace. We were more than just old army buddies, if you know what I mean. That's why it hurts so bad. That's why I want to come with you. He was working on the same thing Vargas has you working on.
trying to track down radio signals from beyond the edges of the map. All seemed a bit boring and scientific to me. But then Ace started saying he thought someone was following him. I asked him to let me come with him when I met him at Rail Nomads to give him the repeater units. But he told me to go back to base. He said he was just jumping at shadows because those radio broadcasts had spooked him. I should have gone with him. Why didn't I go with him? Say, listen. Vargas asked you to look into Ace's death because he thought I was too upset to be professional about it. He didn't want me going off half-cocked and shooting up all of Arizona looking for his killer. But I gotta find this guy. Ace and me, well, we'd been fighting side by side for nigh on 20 years. I'm not letting him die unavenged. So, well, I know it's going against orders, but if you let me tag along and be in at the kill, well, I'll help you find your feet out there. Maybe give you a few pointers along the way. I may be old and slow, but I know the waist's like the back of my hand. What do you say? Cool. No need to tell Vargas why I joined you. If anybody asks, I'm just helping you get oriented, all right? Ranger Command, come in. Roger, Echo One. Just making sure your radio is working. I'll be your dispatcher from here on out. I also wanted to give you a little heads up on your water situation. If you've all got full canteens, you should have enough water to reach the place where Ace died with plenty to spare. But if you're going to go exploring, you'll want to fill up again at any oasis you can find. Remember, your main priority is to recover the repeater units Ace was carrying. Once you've got the devices, you'll be headed to Ag Center and High Pool to install them. But we'll talk about that after you acquire the repeaters. We must, of course, bring Ace's killers to justice. But right now, that's secondary to discovering the location of that signal. 10-4, Echo-1, carry on. Ranger Command out. Roger that, Echo-1. 
When you reach the area where Ace's body was found, give it a good going over. The folks that picked him up said it looked like he crawled there. Maybe you can find some tracks leading to where he was attacked. Copy? 10-4, Echo-1, and check in immediately with any new info. Those repeater units are a top priority. Ranger Command out. Yard, you gotta pay. Fifteen scrap, or we'll break your faces. And my dog will eat your corpses. Really? You do that? Man, this is great. It'll be so much easier to get people to pay our tolls once we have badges. Here, take this scrap. We'll head to the Citadel now. Let me mark my good think spot on your map. That's where I had the idea to set up here.
scratches anywhere. He didn't die quiet, at least. He went down fighting. I wish he was still alive so I could make it suffer. Update for me. Uh, uh, what? Well, I'll be goddamned. We haven't seen any synthetics around for almost 15 years. We better get a closer look at the tech. Mirror Captain might be able to tell us where it came from. See if you can grab a piece of it and bring it back to Mirror Captain the next time you're at the Citadel. Good, but our priority is still those repeaters. Now that you have them, I'm sending you on to complete Ace's mission, which 
was to attach him to the most powerful towers in Arizona so we can get a fix on that mystery signal. One tower is at High Pool, the other is at the Ag Center. Sending you the coordinates now. Don't get shaken up easy. This place is sending shivers up my spine. God damn it, Ace. Why won't you let me come with you? babe. I'll send the ones who did this to hell. So you can kick their asses for eternity. So you will kick their asses for eternity.
right, trainees. I'm taking time out from the dispatch desk to pound you into shape, so pay attention. Fall in. Great job reacquiring the repeaters, recruits. I hope you found a chunk of the synth to bring back for Murkafter. Also, let me personally thank you for finding Ace's killer, whatever it was. Did you? Excellent work. Let me have a look. Getting that feeling of being followed. Damn, it tells a sad story, doesn't it? Guess what came out of the dark was that damn killer robot. Well, looks like your best lead is to find this snake squeezing salesman, whoever he is. Mentions Rail Nomad here, so have a look there if you haven't already. Maybe this fella knows something more, like where the rest of the logbook is. off to our researcher, Captain Murcaptain. She'll be a pig in shit with tech like this to play with. Make us proud, recruits. All right, trainees, fall in. Let me hear the Desert Ranger Rifleman's Creed. 